Hey guys, Nick Kyrgios here. Uh, just finished up on court. Uh, the rain's coming in, it's time for me to cool down. So I'm gonna head home and I got a surprise there waiting for you. Look what's arrived guys, the new PS5. Looks amazing, I'm super psyched to set it up and get playing. New controller, looks awesome, feels awesome in the hand. Can't wait to see how it feels in the game. All right, let's see what they got. So much stuff going on with the controller though. Oh wow, okay, they're, 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 they're good, they're good, they're good, let's go. I started gaming when I was about eight years old. Um, I have an older brother and he was a massive gamer as well and he would never let me ever play these games. He would make me just sit next to him and watch him play. And when I finally got the controller in my hand, Call of Duty was actually the first game I ever played. It's not one yet, keep it tight. Dude, oh, these maps are insane, I love them. Ooh. Wow. Man, the graphics are insane. There you are. There you are. Mm. Feel like people would expect me to go through controllers like I go through tennis rackets, but I'm not going to break these new PS5 controllers, no chance. Um, they're too valuable. No chance. The haptic feedback through the controller is insane. You know, when I'm aiming down the sights, when I'm reloading, when I'm running on the ground, you know, when I'm pulling on the trigger and, and pressing the buttons, uh, it's all tension on the controller. Um, it literally makes me feel like I'm, I'm running around in the, in the level and, and in the game. It's, in, it's incredible. I personally believe that I am the best gamer on the tennis tour. There's a lot of guys that think they can game, and athletes in general, because they're high on confidence, generally think they can game as well, but they can't. I am just as competitive uh, gaming, if not more, than on, on the tennis court. I will never be okay with losing. It does affect my mood a lot. Sometimes I need, you know, 10, 15 minutes to take a breath and just, you know, recalibrate everything and go again. I try and improve on the tennis court every time I step out there, but there's only so much improvement I can do. But with gaming, you know, it's always evolving. New things you've got to experience, new things you can adapt to and get better with. This looks cool. This game's scary as hell. Look, the graphics are so real. It's frightening almost. I think when I reach that 10 year mark professionally, I think I want to try and transition into the gaming environment. And I definitely think I'm good enough, but I want to uh, put all my focus into that. I love it how it tells you like how you're going on the side of the screen. Badass. I haven't played a game like this in years, so, you know, it's exciting. Wow, wow. So sick. It's like watching a movie. When I found out the PS5 was getting delivered to my house today, I was over the moon, honestly, so excited to just, you know, hook it up and, and get playing and, and just experience all the hype and buzz and it definitely lived up to it. It was, it was amazing. Guys, the PS5's got no limits. The graphics, the speed, the experience, the controller in my hand. I could feel the bullets coming out of the gun. I'm about to strap in for a big session. Cameras are off. I'll see you guys later.